With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. According to question, a parallel plate capacitor is made of a two square plates of side A, and the separation between the plates uh, is D, and that D is much less than side of the plate. Okay. The lower triangular portion is filled with the dielectric of a dielectric constant K. So I send the figure. So we have to find the capacitance of the capacitor. Okay. So in that type question, we have to find uh, we have to take a element and uh, find the capacitance of the element and then integrate the relation. Okay. So let's assume that is the parallel plate capacitor and the side of the capacitor plate is A. And the distance between the plates is the distance is D. Okay. And assume that end as x equal to 0, then that is B, that will be x is equal to A. So we have taken an element at distance x okay and the thickness of dx okay and that distance means that height is y so that remaining height will be d minus y okay so according to diagram that element is divided in two part two part because that is with a dielectric constant of k and that is uh, air or vacuum okay so we have uh, two capacitors two different capacitors and both capacitor are connected in series okay so let's assume that uh, uh, lower one that is in a medium with medium that have a capacitance of dc1 okay and that is dc2 so both are connected in series so uh, capacitance of the element will be equal to 1 upon dc is equal to 1 upon dc1 plus 1 upon dc2 okay that is the capacitance equivalent capacitance of that element okay we will find the dc and after we will integrate so as we know that the capacitance of a parallel plate capacitor is c is equal to a f epsilon naught upon d that is in a vacuum and in medium that is a f epsilon naught k upon d d is the distance between the plates and a a is the area of the plate okay so for that element the area will be that length uh, a and the thickness is d x so that area will be equal to a d x so for the both the plate we will use area a d x and the distance between the plates will be different okay so first of all we are finding dc1 so dc1 is area is adx epsilon naught medium is k and the thickness of uh, the capacitor means distance between the plates okay that end and that end that is y okay that is dc1 one more thing that uh, uh, we have x and y both so we will convert that y into x so from that triangle uh, tan theta okay in that uh, triangle let's assume that angle is theta so tan theta will be equal to y upon x and that is also equal to d upon a okay so that is a b and c okay so in the triangle we can say tan theta is y by x is equal to d by a so in that relation y is equal to d upon a into x okay we will put that value in that equation of dc1 so we will get dc1 is equal to a dx epsilon naught k upon okay uh, x into d and a square okay so that is the value of dc1 
now we will find the value of dc2 so dc2 is in air so dc2 is equal to area of the plate is a d sorry a small a dx okay f saline note upon okay in the diagram distance between the ends of the capacitor is d minus y so we will put here d minus y and the value of y is uh, d upon a into x okay so that is a f saline note dx upon d minus dx upon x into d upon a okay so dc2 will be equal to a square f saline note dx upon uh, d is common here and uh, that is a minus x okay so that is the value of dc2 so as we know that both are connected in series then the equivalent capacitance of that element 1 upon dc is equal to 1 upon dc1 plus 1 upon dc2 means 1 upon dc1 is uh, xt upon a square f saline naught k into dx okay plus 1 upon dc2 will be d into a minus x upon a square f saline naught into dx so in that relation 1 upon dc is equal to uh, d upon a square f saline naught dx is common okay and x upon k into minus x plus a okay so 1 upon dc is equal to d upon a square f saline naught into dx and x is common in that relation 1 upon k minus 1 plus a okay so from that relation we have dc and dc is equal to a square epsilon naught dx upon d okay and put that here dx upon x into 1 by k minus 1 plus a okay so let's integrate that relation integration of uh, dc is from 0 to c and the integration of x is 0 to a okay so c is equal to a square f saline naught upon d and the integration of uh, 1 upon x uh, will be equal to ln uh, ln x into 1 by k minus 1 plus a okay upon 1 by k minus 1 okay and limit of that portion is 0 to or also so c is equal to a f saline naught k upon d into 1 minus k okay now we will put the uh, limits that is a so first of all we will put the limit of a so ln uh, when we put the value a so we will get here a by k okay minus ln when we put the value of uh, x0 so that is a so we will get here the value of c is c is equal to a square f saline naught k upon d 1 minus k ln 1 by k or we can say that is a square f saline naught k 
अपॉन डी के माइनस वन एल एन के ओके दैट इज अवर फाइनल रिलेशन ऑफ द कैपेसिटेंस ओके सो लेट्स सी विच ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट सो इसके अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.